Alright guys, today we're going to be ordering $125 worth of Meccano from MeccanoSpares.com. Highly recommended website, especially if you just need a few parts here and there for a project you're working on. Highly recommended. Also, most places send out emails like twice a week or whatever, which makes me not want to shop there. Uh, Edward's been really great. He sent out, I think, one newsletter in the past year. And so I really appreciate that. And so he definitely gets my business. All right, so I'll save you the boring parts and we'll skip right to the basket. You can see after shipping, everything turns out to be exactly 125 bucks. Um, I was going to do 100 bucks, but, you know, I needed some extra parts. So. Purchase completed successfully. So I had a cold when I was recording this video, so I apologize for the sniffling. But yeah, hope you guys enjoy this video. How are you guys doing? Meccano Man here. I'm going to just do a simple unboxing video. I spent about 125 bucks on MeccanoSpares.com to get me some hard to find gears that I can't find here in the States. Um, I always end up with the Rector set and of course I'd rather have the Meccano pieces. So I just thought this would be a fun, quick little video for you guys to watch. I know how much uh, YouTube likes their unboxing videos. I never thought I'd be the guy to uh, do an unboxing video. Um, I honestly think unboxing videos are really cringy. Um, So, I ordered these parts about two weeks ago. Uh, probably about a week and a half ago. And uh, they got here pretty quick, so I'm pretty happy with these guys. Um, shout out to McConnellSpares.com if you ever watch this. Check that out. The mother load. You got some threaded rods, some gears. They're pretty used, but what do you expect? They're, they've got to be over 50 years old. Got some spur gears so I can make a chainsaw. I don't even know what you call that. Some grub screws. <clears throat> got a couple of worm gears. Those look fun. I don't even know what those are called. Why doesn't Meccano make these anymore? Are they too expensive? I don't like the plastic crap they're coming out with nowadays. We'll see if I can put that to use. Something. Got some collars. There's some dog clutches in there. Those look fun. You got a three, a two. Dog clutch. That looks like fun. <clears throat> Who knows, I can use that for anything. Man, these pieces are old school. Meccano made in England. <clears throat> Let me show you this dog clutch again, because I think they're cool. <laughs> That'll be fun. I don't know what these are called, but they're cool. I'm sure some Meccano man out there is watching my videos saying, you're not the Meccano man. You're just starting out, kid. But you know what? Nobody had the name on YouTube, so I took it. Got four of those. Those are hard to come across where I live. So I got four of those. Got some chain. Going to be doing a chainsaw. That'll be pretty cool to have a working chainsaw. I don't even know what you call that, but I got it. Wow, that's kind of a neat piece. Who knows what they use that for? A trip, let's see. Triple throw, eccentric, nickel, original. It's, had, it's seen its days. Let's 
let's breathe some more life into it and give it another shot. Now one looks fairly, fairly good condition. A little crank, some U joints. You can't build Meccano and not have U joints. Those are cool. I can't wait to use those. I got three of them because I know I'll use them. Grub screws, <clears throat> nothing special. I got a bunch of those already, but I figured I'd get a couple extra. Here's some spur gears for the chain. These look fun. Man, they definitely are a little more beat up than I was expecting, but I know I can always refinish them. I got two racks. I don't know what I'm going to use them for, but I think they're cool. Let's see if that fits. Oh yeah. A couple more spurs. <clears throat> I'll end up using these for chainsaws. So I know this will fit, but I'm still going to test it out anyway. Oh yeah, that's going to be a chainsaw. <laughs> if you guys don't know, I'm an arborist in my full-time job. do a lot of tree removals, a lot of tree care, and I think it's important to pay homage to that. There you go. Here's your threaded rods. Pretty cool stuff. Pretty cool stuff. So, well, there you go, guys. That's what 125 bucks gets you. As far as Mocano spares, MocanoSpares.com. Highly recommended. Just don't order all the cool parts because I want to have them someday. You got worm gear. Whatever gear that is. Whatever gear that is. I know there's some guy out there going, You don't even know what you're talking about, dude. But you know what? I'm going to learn as I go. So we got four of those. I think they're called con contrate gears. If it fits together, it fits together. So a few of those. A few of those. Those will be fun. Handful of gears. I was gonna order all gears, but I needed a few other parts. Anyway, <clears throat> this is what I'm looking forward to is making a chainsaw. A working, a functioning chainsaw, and getting these U joints going. If only Meccano realized what their target audience was. Okay, well, thanks for watching, and if you haven't subscribed, subscribe. I'll be doing giveaways on the 100th, 1000th, and 10,000th subscribers if I get that far. Um, I have the confidence that I will, so keep watching, you guys. Thanks. I forgot I have to put all these away. And I don't know that they're going to fit in here, but we'll see. Oh, yeah, I got two boxes. Okay, so let's see. Let's do this one first. I'm kind of OCD, in case you guys haven't realized. I think any good Meccano builder has a little bit of OCD. You can see I don't have any metal gears. I have all plastic. I'm just going to toss these in here, you know that? Actually, I do care. <laughs> the 
These ain't gonna fit in here. This is an absolute mess right now. Well, no. looks like I replaced the wood piece with metal. <laughs> Threaded rods. Those are fun. These are just going to have to go somewhere else.